Today, we're tackling a concern many Android users have, spyware. Is your device behaving strangely? Does someone seem to know private information only kept on your phone? Well, these could be signs that your device is being monitored. So in this video, we'll walk you through seven easy steps to detect and remove spyware from your Android device. Up first, let's understand our enemy. Spyware is malicious software designed to enter your Android phone, gather your personal information, and send it to third parties without your consent. I mean, it can be a real nightmare compromising your privacy and security. All right, now let's dive into the detection and removal steps. First, start by scrutinizing your installed apps. Open Settings, tap Apps, and look for anything unfamiliar or suspicious. If you don't remember installing an app, it could be malicious. To remove an app, just tap on it, then choose Uninstall. Next, check app permissions. Spyware often needs access to certain device features to do things like track your whereabouts or even record your conversations. If an app has permissions it shouldn't need, it's a red flag. So head on over to your phone's permission manager. Here you'll see all the permissions on your device, such as location or microphone, and a list of apps allowed to use them. If you find an app that has unwanted access, then you can either revoke these permissions or uninstall it completely. Next, review the battery usage for your app. You see, spyware can be a resource hog, and if you see an app you don't recognize using lots of battery power, it could be a sign of something untoward. To check this, head over to the Settings app again, and this time tap Battery and Device Care, then Battery. Here you'll find a list of apps that use your battery the most. If you notice a suspicious app using a large amount of battery, uninstall it as it could be a spy app. Okay, so all Android apps include a built-in security scanner called Google Play Protect. This tool can check your device for harmful apps like spyware. So to run a quick scan, open the Play Store app, tap your profile icon, choose Play Protect, then hit Scan. Keeping your operating system and your apps up to date is also extremely crucial. You see, updates often include security patches that keep spyware at bay. Running an update can even remove some threats that may have already infected your device. So, to update your Android operating system, go to Settings, scroll down, and tap Software Update. And to update your apps, just head over to the Play Store app. Now, a dedicated anti-spyware app can often detect more threats than reviewing installed apps or even running a scan with PlayProtect. Certo's Android app is really a great way to do this. It's completely free and can quickly and easily scan your device for spyware, location tracking apps, key loggers, and much more. If a threat is found, simply tap remove and it's gone. Just search Certo in the Play Store or click on the link in the description to download. Now, if you've tried all of the previous steps, but you think your device is still being monitored, then for extra peace of mind, it's worth considering a factory reset. Although this might seem a bit extreme, it's a guaranteed way to remove any spyware from your device. And of course, just make sure you create a backup first to ensure you don't lose any important data. To perform a reset, open the Settings app, tap About, tap Reset, and then choose Factory Data Reset. All right, there you have it. Taking back control of your Android device is simple with the right tools and knowledge. For more tips on safeguarding your digital life, subscribe to our channel. And if you've been affected by Android spyware, please let us know in the comments below. Until next time, stay secure.